um, one of the things she spoke about was the community of Women's Prosperity Network and her one philosophy. And so I was completely intrigued by her. And I had already attended a mastermind within my travel community, the Travel Entrepreneur Success Academy. We had done some masterminds. And I really love that concept of masterminding with peers and um, like-minded individuals to help move you forward. And so Vanessa McGovern, one of my mentors, introduced me to um, Nancy Matthews in Fort Lauderdale. And so I was talking to Nancy after and I said, I would love to have something like this in Baton Rouge. There's nothing there. I've been searching and it's not there. So how can we get this in Baton Rouge? And she said, well, you are now the chapter leader. In Baton Rouge. Yeah, but what you volunteer asked for. <laughs> I know, I know. So that's how it came about. I went through some training with Nancy and the, and the sisters who are the founders of Women's Prosperity Network and um, started Women's Prosperity Network Baton Rouge chapter in May of 2013. Yes. Yeah. So, and it's been a wonderful journey ever since. And then we started with you, Ellen came on board. When did you start as co-leader? Back uh, in remember. March. In March, okay. And Velma is, has been a member for how long? Two years, I think. Two years, yeah, since mm -hmm. part of the beginning. So it's, it's a great chapter. Women's Prosperity Network is about women coming together in the spirit of cooperation. And we focus on the cornerstones of growing yourself, your wealth, and your business. And so that's one of the things that I really, really love about it. Yeah, Velma, what, what, tell us your favorite thing about Women's Prosperity, because you, you've just gotten back from a couple of events. You got to go to the National Conference, which Shannon and I both missed this year. Yeah, yeah the conference, yeah, that was awesome. What I love about our local branch is that y'all are so down to earth and everything that we do on our monthly meetings has to do with bringing each of us together but um in a way that we are able to be ourselves and it's not so busy that we get lost in the shuffle mm -hmm. it's um the agenda we can easily follow and the support from the entire group, from y'all and the teachings and um, the individual attention that y'all give us where we're needing a little help forward. Like, you know, when you reach your goal, you put one hand down and lift another one up. That's what y'all do. And so even if it's a little thing, like for me today, Ellen was helping me find something in PayPal. It's like, I don't know where this stuff is. And that's what y'all do. Just help us be able to take that next step forward that helps us to become successful too. So mm -hmm. that's one one thing I love of the many things. <laughs> Good, we appreciate that. Mm -hmm. Yeah, it is wonderful to be able to help help each other to grow stronger and just just get ideas of mm -hmm. how to do. Back in the spring, in, here in Baton Rouge, we did a, a conference over a weekend called Level Up, mm -hmm. and we stood away from our business and and looked at the big picture. And they they wrote they had us write down a goal and I wrote down a money goal and my first goal that I wrote down seemed like a pretty big goal to me it was was about double what I did did last year probably a little more than double um, and then I thought well that that's that's not big enough that 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 they said big big huge goal and so I went even further now, I didn't hit my big big goal that I I did. But I feel like I did. I hit the hit the first first number that I that I put down that I thought was going to be a big gump number. So obviously that wasn't big enough. Mm -hmm. I don't think I even would have hit that if I had not been just linked in with this com community, with my local community, with calling in on the national calls, uh, with listening to our national mastermind phone call, as well mm -hmm. as going to my local groups and then the Wow Wednesday calls. It just is is something that if I need to be picked up, I can call one of the WPM sisters, either here locally or contact people that I've met at the various conferences in the other the other chapters and just be supported. And and like Velma said, you don't know how to do that. Here's here's how easy it is. And then, then they'll show you and and uh, don't mind showing you twice if that's what it takes. So we are uh, definitely not 
I think some uh, that typical women thing that gets on where we're all in competition and no, no women wants to help another one. Um, if, if that exists, it doesn't exist in, in women's prosperity at all. Mm -hmm. No, it's mm -hmm. not about that. And if any of you on the line, I see we have a few other people on the lab, you can ask questions. Um, and we are more than happy to answer if you don't want to join in on the video. So if you want to type in a question, please feel free to do so. And Ellen just put in the instructions. Just um, type in backslash Q and then type your question. We'll be happy to answer any questions that you may have. It pops it up on a special part in our screen. So if it gets too much chatter, uh, we won't miss a question that you have. Right. Because this is a, a, an international organization now. Uh, started in yeah. South Florida and moved up a little bit in Florida. And uh, we're now in Jamaica and somewhere in Europe, right? In the Netherlands. In the Netherlands. Mm -hmm. Yeah, in the mm -hmm. Netherlands. I believe we are up to 16 or 17 chapters now. So even if you're not watching this from our local Baton Rouge area, where Shannon and I are from, chances are there is a chapter either near you now or one that will open up in 2016 that you can join and be part of this, this wonderful prosperity network. I think prosperity is such a key term. In fact, I've tried to not use the initials anymore the, and call it the Women's Prosperity Network. And a lot of times I have to go back and retype it because I, I think it's important to have that that prosperity term focused right. on right and it's it's prosperous in so many ways you know it's, a, mm -hmm. it's it brings you prosperity and friendships and your business and yourself so it really enriches all aspects of your life i think it really mm -hmm. does so um there are many events taking place this week of course we have thanksgiving next week so i think a lot of the events got captured into into this second week of november it is just the second week right yeah, um, <laughs> yeah. something like that <laughs> the 17th of this month miami has a special event a happiness hour um jamaica also has a happiness hour on the 18th there it's is a mastermind <laughs> oh yeah I, I i i think i need to, to go to that one can you get me a trip to that real yeah, quick i think, I think we should I'll get go. a discount <laughs> I think we go together. <laughs> I think we should. So Coming the West to Delta. Delta. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> I'm in. That, that's right, Arian. Uh Westchester and has a mastermind on uh, the eighteenth, and then both Palm Beach, Treasure Coast, Orlando, and Baton Rouge. Oh, and Nassau County. So around the nation there are one, two, three, four masterminds going on on thursday what what power wow. is that i mean wow, all over cool. the nation people all masterminding on the same topic peace yep. prosperity and happiness during these holiday seasons i'm so right. looking forward to talking about that peace part during the holiday season because i'm already going okay how can i get it all in it all done mm -hmm. nope that's what we're going to talk about this month is being present not just during the holidays, well, especially during the holidays, but just in, in everyday moments. I mean, be present. Um, turn off your phones when you're in a conversation with someone. You know, respect other people's time and value their time and the, the time that you're spending with them. We're going to go into detail about that because that that is your present. That is your gift to them by giving your presence and listening and honoring them and just paying full full attention to them and not thinking, Oh, what should I be doing? And I wonder what else she's going to talk about. Maybe I should let me let me let me look down here at my phone real quick and do a text. That is so disrespectful. And but it's the way we've been. We're, we're so trained now to just go, go, go. So it's time for us to look at ways to take a step back and be in the present moment and enjoy those moments and, and be mindful to each other, and respectful to each other. So we're going to go over that in our mastermind this month. And if you haven't masterminded before, the, the thing about this networking group, and I love all my networking groups, some of them about coming to a speaker that's going to give me something that I could do at my business that's from the outside. Some of them are about renewing friendships and getting business cards for new people that have come to that. I come back with a stack of business cards that uh, I may or may not do anything with. But this group, we really sit down and talk to each other 
and we have ideas and you you when you have more than one brain together what is it napoleon hill said when you get two or more minds together you form a third brain that is greater than you know the one brain that you have together and mm -hmm. that's what we do every month is we sit down and you talk with each other and you say here's an issue that i have or you know on this topic man i, I this is my short shortfall and how do y'all handle that or here's how i handle whether it was time management or social media or whatever our topic was, you got back with great ideas. Uh, one of our members, right. Joan, was able to add a whole nother aspect to her business because she sold just time. She's, she does a uh, Far East massage and you know she doesn't, can't add more time to her day, but she could sell the oils and the lotions that everybody loved when they were there. So she was able to after talking with with people at our meeting, figure out how to add that to her business and grow her business in a new way she hadn't thought of before. And that's mm -hmm. the kind of thing that you can get out of coming to a Women's Prosperity Network meeting. Yeah. So, well, I um, don't see any more questions and anything else that y'all have to add? No, I don't think so. We'd love to have um, some guests at our uh, meeting this week and um, if you're a member and you're on the call please bring a guest tell your friends um, if you're watching the replay and you want to find out more information contact myself or Ellen or you can go to womensprosperitynetwork.com and get a list of all the events that are coming up here in Baton Rouge and worldwide that's right that's right womensprosperity.com womensprosperitynetwork.com and uh, you can, can get the link to register for our event. Our event is this Thursday at 11.15 at Bonefish Grill in Baton Rouge, Louisiana. But I just read off the list of where they are. And I think I, I stopped at ours. So sorry, uh, Fort Lauderdale and Suffolk County and Atlanta, because they're all coming up on Friday and Saturday of this month. So uh, you have Suffolk County, New York, Fort Lauderdale, Florida has a special event to mastermind workshop and Atlanta, Georgia, which is just reformed. So that's just wonderful that we're, we're back in places that, that took a little break because people just realized I can't do without the women's prosperity network. I, I would let's figure out how to get it back in our life. Right. So right. Well, I think that that is all that we have for today. Unless all you right. ladies have something else you want to add. I think I'm good. Velma? All right. I'm good. Um, I appreciate y'all for getting the word out um, and for being the support system that you are for all of us. And because we all have so many different businesses from real estate to Eastern massage, you know, and everything in between, <laughs> but you all address each one of us wherever we are in whatever business we are. So what the sisters are putting out for us to help us come together during the mastermind supports every single one of us, no matter what right. field we're in, no matter what jobs we have or jobs we are trying to um, develop. Mm -hmm. It's supportive along the way, even if we're just starting. Our, excuse me. Yep. Our business, <laughs> um, sorry. That's okay. <laughs> or if we've been in business for a long time, you know, mm -hmm. there, it really and truly is a whole lot within the Women's Prosperity Network and within our mastermind that supports us no matter where we are. And right. that's the comforting part. We don't have to worry about not fitting in because we automatically fit in. That's the way they, they created it. So that no matter where we are, what our businesses are, we have what we need right there. Exactly. Yeah, whether you've been in business for, for years or you're just starting out, there's always things that you can have that you learn from and again that that masterminding the networking and actually talking out an issue is what our strong suit is at women's prosperity network yeah all right well we will see you all on our next lab i don't think we've scheduled yeah. it yet but we'll keep this this conversation going because we love talking about women's prosperity network yep sounds good thanks ellen thanks thank Velma. Thank thanks everyone thank else you all call. so much thank all right bye-bye Okay. Bye. Bye.